Hello everyone, welcome to the Embedded Laboratory. In today's video, I will show you guys how to install Mosquito Broker on Raspberry Pi and then demonstrate how we can subscribe and publish the messages to and from the same Raspberry Pi device. After this, I will also show you guys how to subscribe to messages from an external Mosquito Broker, such as test.mosquito.org, and here for publishing, I will be using the application developed in the Qt. Regarding the MQTT tutorial with Qt, please check the description of this video, as I have already posted many tutorials on that. But before proceeding further, I would like to thank the sponsor of this video, PCBWay. With more than a decade in the field of PCB prototype and fabrication, they are committed to meeting the needs of their customers from different different industries in terms of the quality, delivery, cost effectiveness, and any other demanding requests. They are one of the most experienced PCB manufacturers in the world. I hope my video's viewers will visit their website at least once to show their offerings. As a first step, I have to install the Mosquito Broker, but before proceeding further let's update our, our packages. This can be done by using the command sudo apt update and then sudo apt upgrade. And then to install the Mosquito Broker on Raspberry Pi, we have to use the command sudo apt install mosquito mosquito clients. Once the installation is complete, to make mosquito auto start when the Raspberry Pi boots, we need to run the command sudo system control enable mosquito service. After executing this command, the mosquito broker will automatically start when the Raspberry Pi starts. I will restart the Raspberry Pi, and after this, I will show you guys how to publish and subscribe the messages locally. Now we will test the Mosquito publish and subscription of the messages. For this I will open two terminal sessions, one for subscription of the messages and another one for publication of the messages. On the left hand side terminal session, I am writing the command to subscribe the messages with name topic on the local host. While on the right-hand side terminal session, I am writing the command to publish the messages with name topic on the local host, as you can see, when the enter key is pressed, the messages are published, and on the subscription terminal these messages are received. And now in the last section. I will show you guys how to use the MQTT application developed in Qt to publish the messages to the external server, and then on Raspberry Pi, I am subscribing to these topic messages. Don't get confused with Raspberry Pi and Qt Creator running on Windows screen, actually I am accessing the Raspberry Pi from Windows machine using VNC server. This MQTT Qt application is already provided in Qt examples. Please check the description of this video to get the tutorial links related to this. Now from the Raspberry Pi terminal session, I am subscribing to the messages with topic name, topic 12345, and here we will be using the free external MQTT broker, that is test.mosquito.org. As can be seen here, whatever I am publishing from the application running on Windows, I can receive all the messages on the terminal window of the Raspberry Pi. That's all from this short video, we will use the knowledge gain in this video to build a home automation project in future. So, if you like this video, press the like button, share this video with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe this YouTube channel. Thank you.